Okay, so this is one that doesn't, that's still occupied. Um, shooting a video of it. I forget the year, I think it's a 2000 and something. I, I'm guessing it's a Redmond, but we'll kind of go through it. I would say its condition on a scale of 1 to 10 is 9.9. .9. Based on what I've seen so far, there's a few little things. I'm looking here at a... Look at that. That's funny. That's funny. This cabinet facing just literally needs glued back on. It's just coming right off there. So not 100% perfect. I can see a little, little bit here that is off kilter up there at the top. And this, this door has got the same exact thing where this paper is literally coming off. I guess that's the same problem there. All of them or several of them. This one's over here solid, but this one is plastic coated and it needs glued on. That'd be easy fix. Looks like it happened to some of those other pieces as well. Um, I don't know if the fridge goes with it, so I'm not going to include that in this. It's a oak trim on the front edge. Tiny bit of, of discolor right there, but nothing serious. Um, big corner thing to get in. This is a gas house. Um, and it has a brand new water heater being installed as we speak. It's got a covered front porch. I'll show you that in a minute. Actually, I'll go ahead and poke my head out there real quick and show that. So it's got this covered front porch with a nice sitting area. Wood's going to need restained, but other than that, it's it's nice. So then as we come in the house, we got a little discoloring up there. But it's a uh, it's fiber cement. I don't know what they had here, but this is fiber cement siding. So you come in, you got your dining room, kitchen, the living room. Wide open down the hallway. Um, there's some discolored on this, the doorway, or this, not doorway, it's a, I'm not sure what that is there. Oh, it's a coat closet, but it's big. So then, living room is nice, has nice blinds. Very big living room, open to the dining room, closed off from the kitchen. Going down the hallway, the carpet is a little bit on the worn side. Um, some kind of inexpensive trim around the doors. This is the laundry room back door. Good storage in there, good size. Um, haven't seen any damage to any of the doors. There's a little spot there on the ceiling that little condensation. The, it does have a plastic bathtub, which are the lowest quality. I hate these. That's why I think this is a Redmond. It looks to be in good shape, but they're never fabulous. I haven't seen any damage to any doors or anything like that. Seems to be in very good shape. There's a couple little holes like somebody had mounted something on that door. We're not going to go in that one because he's working in there. I've got a picture of it though. There's a tiny little crack up there on the line. A little blemish there. Clearly girls room. It's missing the doors for the closet there. But beyond that, and it's also missing the uh, smoke detector. So that's bedroom number two. This did have an upgrade package with the mortised in three hinge doors. No, no, that was the old one. The new one's right here. Oh, that's the new one. And doesn't have a separate shower in the master. 
another spot here of uh, moisture damage. A little moisture damage around there. And this around could be replaced. I would change the whole thing. It's a big, I don't know, I think I, a seat, because why not? Anyway, there's a storage back behind there for linen. Everything here seems to be in good condition. I haven't seen any holes in any doors. It's got a little crack up there. No, no, I'm just, is there any blems in here? I'm just... Just come in. I, mean, any, I didn't notice any holes in any doors or anything oh, like that, but um, I want to point this out. The um, in the next room there, there's a little hole in the ceiling. I saw that. Where something was, you know, attached and then it oh. dropped out because um, it was poorly affixed. No other... Other than that, I think everything's pretty solid. Okay. Um, obviously, you you there's, walk around the exterior. There's no doors in that closet. And you're, I assume no, and they're so. gone. Okay. That, that, those have no other holes in any no, no holes in no doors holes. or anything like that. Those are real common. Yeah, no, I've never okay. kicked through. <laughs> I, I had a girlfriend who tried to break into the bedroom once, but she didn't break the door. <laughs> she didn't drive very hard. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll go ahead and look around the outside. Thank you. Yeah, of course. Um, honestly, I've been here 14 years. Oh. Well, it's almost like you own it then, almost. I, if I could have bought it, I probably should have bought it, but now I'm, I can't afford this now. Uh, it's a neighborhood. <laughs> All right, thank you. Yeah. Okay, and then we're back out the front. Um, could use a little bit of staining on, on some of the railing there. has rain gutters with leaf guards in them oh this is nice it has a gable dormer over here which was a nice nice break um, siding all looks good Little spots right there need to be replaced, but that's kind of a given. Rain gutters down the side. Looks like they had some plants that grew up there. That's what those plants do. I forget what they're called, but those climbing ones. Oh, I didn't want to let go. Uh, 14 years. It looks like it could use a repaint. It's a little bit. It does have nice long overhangs down the side. That end looks good. There's a water faucet uh, thing there. That's a really nice looking place. A little bit of stain on the staining on the thing and it doesn't really need to be repainted right away. You could use gently pressure washed and cleaned. It has a nice long overhanging down this side as well. That's nice. I'm not sure how you'd wash those those ivies that have been climbing up off or if they would come off with something but that has a long it's also got a continuous roof event which might mean I'd have to look but it might mean there's no um, protruding vents on the top here you have an outlet back door
another outlet over there that has a crinkle on that rain gutter unfortunately where something smacked it I don't know if I can get up to where I can get high enough to see if there's there's the roof there's a bird on the roof nope it does have um, cans or whatever on the top of the roof so but overall it's a really nice looking house on the outside and it's good side on the inside so that's this house